well, we're going to make the mistakes. I mean, John opened up. And, and now we're going to keep talking about how he doesn't know how to enter things into the MLS. I don't know how many times we've already said that during this <laughs> session. Oh, come on, give me another one. Okay, go. <laughs> um, we're going to make mistakes. So we're we're going to make them. But um, the important thing is to learn from those mistakes and to not make those mistakes again, right? It happens. Um, it continues to happen for me. Um, and I'm sure um, for for a lot of other people who have been doing it for a long time. Um, I, I, I want to, I'm going to sort of um, spin doctor your question to get back to what Akil was talking about with Project REAP. Um, and this, uh, this could feed into the, the things to avoid doing. The things to avoid doing is thinking that there is not space for you um, because maybe you're, you don't see someone who looks like you or you don't, um, you don't have the role models who you feel you connect with. Um, there's a few things. Project Reap is great. Uh, it's a great program. I think they put the website up in the chat on how to learn more about Project Reap. Um, the other thing is NAR has been doing a great job. I sit on the Create Advisory Board and Create is the commercial magazine that NAR puts out. And their most recent issue, um, is about how make how you can make um, what is exactly um, making commercial real estate. Thank you, making commercial real <laughs> estate inclusive. Thank you, Akil. Thank you for having that. Um, and so um, it's important to know that there are uh, it is diverse. It it is um, on the face less diverse than it could be. Um, but, you know, last month, the Chicago Association of Realtors hosted its second annual um, diversity summit. It's the 360 summit. And T. Dallas Smith out of Atlanta was one of our keynote speaker. Um, he had a fireside chat with our current president, Sarah Ware, who's also a commercial realtor. And um, T. Dallas Smith has a great story um, and he's a great speaker. Um, and I'm looking forward to seeing him at the C5 Summit in September. Hopefully, John and Akil, you guys will be there as well. We're like the three of us are now the three Musketeers. Oh, yeah. Yes. Um, and so, so we have to look um, to not feel that we don't belong in a space that we want to be in. Um, it's a mistake to think that doesn't exist. And there are support um, groups. <laughs> Unfortunately, they exist. But but that what I mean by that is there is support there are people who have done that and most people will reach back and help others up so don't be afraid to ask for help um it doesn't necessarily have to be from someone who looks like you so for instance a mentor of mine isn't just going to be another woman in that business you can find mentorship and support and advice and help um from a whole slew of different types of people and um I recommend looking for it, looking for it in any space you can find it and to take the help when it's offered. 